Hi and welcome to MSY Invest Tutorials. I'm going to teach and guide you to understand the MSY Dropshipping app via WordPress WooCommerce Part 2. This includes how to upload bulk and single products and understanding the order process. Please note that this is for dropshipping customers for WooCommerce. Let's begin. We have two options for uploading the product to your store, one would be in bulk and the other is gradually uploading it. Let me teach you the gradual way of uploading it. On the MSY sidebar, click Products. This will lead you to the product page which is actively connected to our database. Let me explain its features. On the top left part you will have a command for bulk actions and below it would remove from shop which is very straightforward. The next one would be the select category which I will discuss later for the bulk upload option of the app. Under product type, we have imported and non-imported filter. Let's check the imported filter. These are the products which is already imported and currently active in the store. Now let's check the non-imported products and let's try to upload a product from there. As an example, I will use this stand mixer. On the right part of the table, you will see this icon, which is an import button. Let's click it. Please note, after clicking the import button we still need to do one more thing as it only imports the product from our database to your import page. Now let's hit OK. Let's go to the import page by clicking import on the sidebar. Here is the import page and this is where we edit or customize the product to our preference. Let's check it out. There is the title bar, you can always change or edit the title to match your store's layout. Here is the price which is the MSY or the wholesale price. Here we have the margin already in a monetary form. This amount was automatically calibrated from the price setting from which we set up for 30%. This means that the 26.33 margin amount is 30% of the 87.75 wholesale price. As for the tax price percentage, this is the one we set under the price setting for 20%. And all of this info from price to margin to tax percentage is automatically computed by the system as the sale price. And let's say you would want to change the amount of a specific product. All of it is completely customizable from the tax percentage to the margin amount and automatically changes the total price or the sale price. This setup is so flexible that you can control your profit per product. And, these changes would only work on the product that you set up and will not affect other products globally. Now we have the option category, this populates if your store has categories, allowing you to automatically have the product in the specific category that your store has without setting it up manually from your dashboard. Now beside the detail tab would be the description tab. This contains the product description. And this too is completely customizable to your preference, allowing you to completely control the design and the content of your product page. You may add, edit, and remove anything to your liking. You may change the font and create bullet points. This feature is limitless. And as for the last tab is the image tab, which contains all of the images of the product. Once it's all set, all you need is to click the save product button in any tab that you're in. After clicking, you will receive a prompt like this that the product has already been uploaded to your store. Let's hit OK and check it. On the sidebar under WooCommerce, click Products. This will automatically load your product under WooCommerce. And here is the stand mixer that we just uploaded. Now let's check it in our online shop. Let me refresh this. And wow, here it is. It's fast and easy. Now this time we are going to upload the product in bulk using the category option. Let's begin. On the product page, let's go to the select category. These are the product categories that we have in our shop. As an example, I'm going to use bedroom essentials. After choosing the category, you need to click the filter button. This will auto-populate all of the products under the category bedroom essentials. Now in order to have it all selected, go to the tick box under the bulk action. Let's click the radio box and all of these products will be selected. To confirm this product, we would need to click the import category button. 
After clicking it we will have a prompt that all of the products are successfully imported. Then, let's hit OK. Now let's visit all of our imported products from the import page. And here are all the bedroom essential categories that we just imported and same as the previous method, this page is completely customizable. You may edit, erase, and add to prep this product for your store style. You may also edit the margin and the tax percentage if you like. Same as my previous guide you can set everything up from here before uploading the product. Again, if you need to do anything on the product feed, this is the only part of the app to do so. As for the category, you may choose the category of your store, in that way upon uploading, the product will automatically show its designated category in your store. Once you are already set, let's click the bulk import and save to store button. Please note. Due to the volume of the product that is being uploaded to your store, this might take a while. Please bear with us. After it's done, you will have a prompt that the products are already uploaded to your store. Let's click OK. To check it, let's go to the products on the sidebar tab below the WooCommerce tab. And there you are. Now let's check it into our store. Let me refresh the page. And here are all the products that are already active in your online shop. Now we are going to check the orders and how to process them on the MSY dropshipping app. For us to experience it, we are going to create a dummy order or a test order. Let's begin by using this product. Okay. Let me continue to process this purchase. While I'm checking some info, I'm going to set your expectation that what I'm doing is just a test order and this might have some slight difference from the actual order. But as far as the MSY dropshipping app is concerned, this is the whole nine yards of the process. Please note, all orders will be automatically placed on your MSY dropshipping account, but you would need to manually fulfill it from there. Okay, I'm done processing the test order and let me check a few things here. Now we have successfully done the test order, this time we are going to check it. On the MSY app on the sidebar, we will look for pending orders, this is where all new orders go after it was successfully placed. And here is the white duvet that we use to process the test order. Now, in cases where you have a lot of orders, and you would want to process them in one go, all you need to do is click the process all order button and it will automatically go to the all orders tab which i will explain later now in some cases you would want to process selected orders only you would need to click the radio box then choose only the order that you would want to process and click the process selected orders button since we only have one order let me show it to you and click it after confirming it you will have a notification then let's hit OK. Now to continue, we would need to go to the All Orders tab in the MSY app from the sidebar to check out processed orders. Here is the white duvet that I just recently purchased and this info will go directly to my MSY dropshipping account and I would need to manually fulfill it from there. Everything about this app is straightforward and very easy to use. I hope I was able to explain everything in a very simple manner. However, if you do have some questions and clarification, you can always contact us for assistance. This concludes the tutorial of the MSY dropshipping app via WordPress WooCommerce. And thanks for choosing MSY Invest as your business partner. For more info, you can visit our website www.msy.be or call us at 32252053333 or visit us directly at Polder32840, Turhagen. Rumst, Belgium. See you soon. Cheers.